Hi, I'm Vicki Eisenstein with ID8 TV, and I'm here at the Sawdust Art Festival with John Barber. John, why don't you tell me a little bit about all these amazing glass art pieces around us? Uh, yes. <clears throat> you know, I've been blowing glass now for 45 years. I apprenticed in Bavaria, Germany. I spent my first three years and uh, learned with a master glass blower there and returned in 72 and I've been building my own studios, equipment, furnaces to uh, continue blowing glass and uh, this is now my 41st year at the Sawdust Festival. <laughs> wow, you're an old hand, that's amazing. How did you get into glass? Well, you know, funny story, I mean from the age of five I wanted to be a Grand Prix racer, okay? So my father and I, we started racing go-karts when I was six years old until I was 19 and at that, uh, that year two of my friends died in a race and I went, you know, there must be something else. And that, so I have a sister that lives in Munich and I went to visit her and uh, they, her husband was raised in a small village in Bavaria where they've been blowing glass for 1,100 years, you know. So I had a tour of the factory and it was just one of those things that I saw it done and I just went, I could do that and what a challenge it would be. And so I ended up uh, then staying in, in Bavaria for three years and uh, have stuck with it all these years. and. It's still a challenge in 41 years, still a challenge, but have reached a, a master status, you know, that in Europe there's a 20-year apprenticeship before maybe you're considered for the master's bench. And, uh, you know, I've been producing one-of-a-kind works, almost 12 tons a year of art glass wow. that is now covering the globe, you know, so... Yeah. Uh, do you have a favorite? Do you prefer making vases or do you like making fish sculptures like I see over there? What, what's your favorite type of thing to make? You know, I make a pretty broad spectrum of works. Uh, I, I like that each thing I make has a different challenges. And uh, that's what I love is the challenge, you know. Stemware, stemmed goblets, probably one of the hardest things to make in blown glass. And for, for 25 years I sold at the Renaissance Fair. And there I had a market for a single goblet. Uh -huh. And that gave me the ability to develop my skill. And you know now I make these stemware and like it takes me seven and a half minutes to make one. That's it? But that's how it's done. You have The longer it's on that blowpipe, the more likely it is to crack, break, fall off, or something to go wrong. So you have to learn how to make these very quickly, you know. Mm -hmm. I like making chandeliers. I have a chandelier hanging here that poses different challenges, you know. So that's what I look for, is to challenge myself so I don't get, you know, board. <laughs> yeah, that's amazing. That's so cool. Um, where can people go to find your work? My my home and studio is right here in Laguna Canyon mm -hmm. and I'm you know open there during when the summer's over we open we have a showroom there and people are welcome to stop in and see how it's done and so that. Okay well thank you so much for the interview and uh, yeah thanks for watching ID8 TV. This is Vicki Eisenstein at the Sawdust Festival.